In West St. Lucia has successfully relocated eight informal occupants in Choiselle to allow for the construction of the Grand Hyatt Hotel development at Sabuisha. The houses were built between September and December 2022 following a process of consultations and site inspections spanning as far back as January 2021. The new homes, which were funded by Invest St. Lucia, were formally handed over to the residents on Tuesday, January 10, 2023. Chairman of Invest St. Lucia, Lyndon Arnold, says this project exemplifies the agency's commitment to not only stimulating investment, but improving the lives of St. Lucians. We brought a human aspect to it. Um, land ownership is something that is very emotional. And these residents have been, you know, on these other lands there for quite a long time. That's all they, they know. So there's a certain level of attachment. So we really had to understand and feel what they were going through to uproot them and, and bring them somewhere else. And that is why we engaged them in consultation, underst understood their need and made a commitment to them in each and every case that we would improve the quality of life, what they, what they are living in to what we intend to give them. And that is why we are so thrilled about what, you know, the keys that we've handed them today. While the relocation process was not without its challenges, the agency remained dedicated to meeting the varied needs of the eight occupants. According to CEO of Invest St. Lucia, Octavian Charles, this underscores the vital role which the agency continues to play as it relates to the country's socio-economic development. This project is an indication of how serious we are when it comes to addressing the needs and the concerns of the communities in St. Lucia. If we look at what existed before and what is happening now, it shows that we were committed to uplift, to upgrade the residents, and that is what we are doing. We have even gone beyond that, and what we intend to do is to also follow up, as, as we would see a follow-up to ensure that even after they have settled that everything is fine with them. So as a corporate, good corporate citizen, we want to make people's lives better. You know, this is not about a project. This is about enhancing lives to make people more comfortable. Parliamentary representative for Schwozel Saltibus, Honorable Bradley Felix, was present to witness the handover. Felix stressed that the opportunity to legally own land will empower residents. The biggest pleasure to me is the fact that we have several um, new homeowners. And when I say new, the fact that they now have the opportunity to own the homes that they live in. And we all know, you know how that empowering that can be. Um, um, all of the people that have been relocated were living on, on lands that did not belong to them. They were, in fact, squatters. And now they are being given an opportunity by Invest St. Lucia to own the houses, well, to own the land that the houses are on. The houses actually belong to them. And, and from what I understand, the, the rates are very, very affordable. The 345-room luxury Grand Hyatt Hotel is scheduled to be completed by 2025 and is expected to create over 600 permanent and part-time jobs during the construction phase and upon completion. Local officials also anticipate that the project will significantly increase St. Lucia's visibility, generating various benefits for Schwozel and surrounding communities.